Introducing the Cryoblade, a unique cryogenic laboratory mill with revolutionary grinding capabilities. Cole Palmer is introducing a new cryogenic mill to the cryogenic product family, which includes the spec sample prep 6775, 6875, and 6875D freezer mill. The cryogenic blade incorporates an easy to use touchscreen display to operate the mill. Products are available in either a 115 volt or 230 volt. The cryo blade comes complete with the cryogenic bowl assembly, which includes an outer bowl with handle, inner cryogenic processing bowl, and a lid blade assembly, power cord, operation manual, and a liquid nitrogen connection, which attaches the cryogenic hose to a low pressure liquid nitrogen tank, 22 PSI. The liquid nitrogen tank is not included with purchase of the cryo blade or sold by Cole Palmer. The customer will need to source liquid nitrogen tank suppliers. A 160 liter liquid nitrogen tank is recommended for use with the Cryoblade. The Cryoblade is part of our Spec Sample Prep brand that was designed with a new look for the Cole Palmer brand. Coming soon, other Spec Sample Prep product designed with a new look for the Cole Palmer brand. The Cryoblade is a unique cryogenic laboratory mill with revolutionary grinding capabilities. It has a liquid nitrogen feature that freezes the sample and improves laboratory safety requirements, keeping the user out of danger with its no LN contact patent pending technology. The large capacity bowl can process up to one kilogram which fulfills government regulations where testing labs must grind a complete package of vegetables or fruits to satisfy batch process requirements. There's no other cryogenic mill like it on the market. Primary industry markets. Food testing, including government, academic, USDA, is a major focus for the cryoblade due to regulations in many countries that require measurement of pesticide residue in foods. Cannabis testing is anticipated to be another major customer since most countries and states that have legalized cannabis also mandate pesticide residue testing. Secondary industry markets. Farmer, biotech, deals with tissue samples can be used for grinding up tissue and possibly for research. Wildlife animal programs are another potential customer base since they have animals in their care who have been exposed to pesticides either through direct ingestion, environmental exposure, or by eating other animals who were poisoned. It may be necessary to identify the pesticide to which they were exposed. Additionally, laws such as federal insecticide, fungicide, and the Rodenticide Act in the U.S. require testing that impact of pesticides on wildlife. This includes terrestrial fill dissipation studies where soil and plants are sampled for pesticide residue. Applications. Pesticide applications include the catcher's method, which is described as quick, easy, cheap, effective, rugged, and safe. The Cryoblade is highly effective at improving extractions from food products. Fine grinding, also known as comminution, improves pesticide recovery analyzed by LC or GCMS. What is a pesticide? Pesticides are any toxic chemicals used to kill, repel, or control insects, animals, fungi, or plants that cause economic damage to crops or agriculture. What is pesticide analysis? Pesticide residue testing is a process that identifies the pesticide residue levels in food products. The catcher's method workflow. Step one, the sample, fruits or vegetables, is cut into small pieces, one to two inches. Unless the whole piece like a strawberry can fit through the lid aperture or opening. Step two, the sample is weighed and added to the cryoblade through the lid aperture. Step three, 
The sample is ground to a found powder, also known as comminution. Step four, a small amount of sample, two to five grams of the ground powder is transferred to a 50 milliliter centrifuge tube. Step five, add two large ceramic cylinders to the 50 milliliter tube. Step six, 15 milliliters of acetonitrile to extract the pesticide plus magnesium sulfate salt to remove the water are added to the 50 milliliter tube and the cap is applied. Mechanical mix in the 2010 Gina grinder for two to three minutes or by hand. Mechanical mixing is recommended to ensure good extraction of pesticides into the solvent, acetonitrile. After the sample mixing is complete, remove the tubes and centrifuge at 14,000 CF for five minutes to separate the liquid solvent layer from the solid sample layer. Step nine, transfer the solvent layer to an auto sampler valve and analyze by GC, MS, or LC. The liquid nitrogen connection. When installing the transfer hose, we recommend the use of Teflon tape on all threaded connections and tighten the nuts with a wrench. Cryogenic hoses are sold separately and come in four feet and six feet in length. We recommend inserting the hose in the insulated foam that's included to wrap the Ellen hose to minimize condensation during operation. The hose should be secured as close as possible to the unit. The cryogenic hose should exit the unit and lay on the counter without pressure or tension exerted on it. We recommend keeping a short distance between the Ellen tank and the cryo blade. This will minimize liquid nitrogen consumption. The safety relief valve. The purpose of the safety relief valve is to have an outlet for the liquid nitrogen vapor in case the mill and the supply tank valves are both shut and pressure builds up inside the hose. The Ellen tank pressure must be between 20 to 22 PSI. The safety valve must never be removed. The cryo blade weighs over 100 pounds and must be placed on a sturdy laboratory bench top. The cryo blade should be operated on an open bench top in ambient air 4 degrees to 35 degrees Celsius or 40 degrees to 90 degrees Fahrenheit with relative room humidity 0 to 95 percent. The cryogenic bowl is easily removed and dishwasher safe. Additional cryogenic bowls are available for purchase, allowing the user to have multiple bowls dedicated for specific sample types. Having multiple cryogenic bowls saves time in washing the bowl between runs. Simple touchscreen display. The cryo blade has three preset protocols, only for the liquid nitrogen process for sample amounts in the 300 gram range, 600 gram range, and the one kilogram range. The preset protocols keeps the operation simple. By using the preset protocol, the user does not have to develop a protocol through experimentation to grind the sample to a powder. It also has programmability options for different applications. The cryogenic process. Use with liquid nitrogen is automatically dispensed, or, if used with dry ice, the dry ice must be manually added to the cryogenic bowl. The sample is pre-weighed, example, 300 grams of strawberries, and loaded into the cryogenic bowl. The cryogenic bowl is then inserted into the cryo blade and locked in place. The 300 gram preset protocol is recalled from the touchscreen window. To start the run, press the start button on the touchscreen. The sample is ground to a powder in approximately 15 minutes. The simple touchscreen display. The cryo blade has three protocols only for the liquid nitrogen process for sample amounts in the 300 gram range, 600 gram range, and the one kilogram range. The preset protocols keep the operation simple. By using the preset protocols, the user does not have to develop a protocol through experimentation to grind a sample to a powder. It also has programmable options 
for different application, which allows the user to tailor made a specific protocol to a specific sample. Performance and quality. Short run times with homogeneous results each time is achievable with the CryoBlade. User friendly, touchscreen interface and easy handling, insertion and removal of the cryogenic bowl. Reproducibility, efficient grinding yield, same results each time. Low maintenance, easy to clean cryogenic bowl and the stainless steel knife blade. Multilingual interface, including English, French, Spanish, Italian, Portuguese, German, just to name a few. Reasonable lead times, typically two to four weeks, an order will be processed and shipped. Large capacity, customers have been requesting larger sample sizes due to their regulatory requirements. This product is unique in its ability to process up to one kilogram per grind. Stainless steel grinding blade, designed for durability with a unique shaped knife blade to grind the sample to a powder. Safety features. Liquid nitrogen can cause severe frostbite. Auto dispense liquid nitrogen is unique to this product and significantly improves safety. Emergency stop button. The red emergency stop button on the front of the cryo blade cuts power to the mill in case of an emergency. For more information and resources, please visit our website at colepalmer.com.